Hello and thank you for viewing. Today's daily challenges for Saturday, November 28th, 2020 are 10 animals killed with a bow, one go on call and complete a story mission, one herb picking contest completed, three items sold to a fence, three player kills in Deadeye in showdowns, five rams head picked, two Virginia possums skinned, one bounty hunt completed with five minutes or more left, two bounty targets taken down with bolas, three more than one bounty target brought in at once, 20 carcasses donated within 10 minutes, two goods sold to distant buyer, two resupply missions completed, three collectibles sold to Madame Nazar, three family heirlooms found, three lost jewelry found, two crafted toxic moonshine, two moonshine bar danced for two minutes, two played with a band for two minutes, five animal samples sold to Harriet, three desert animal samples taken, and three farmland animal samples taken. And today you'll find Madame Nazar over in tall trees north of Manzanita Post. And you can get 10 challenges for your rolls today if when you are at 8 of 9 completed, you simultaneously complete one bounty hunt completed with 5 minutes or more left and 3 more than one bounty target brought in at once. However, that I do believe is going to require you to do 3 bounty missions in order to get 3 more than one target brought in at once. So I'm just going to leave it to you if you think that's worth it or not. And here's a map of Ram's Head. This particular map I got from Discord from the Compendium Bot by typing exclamation point find ram's head there is a link down in the description inviting you to join discord it's also a great spot to find someone to posse up for those posse and multiplayer challenges you can find ram's head also you know in cumberland forest here's a zoomed in spot as well as over in big valley not far from our good old friend harriet davenport virginia possum you can find in many many locations Keep in mind, it is a nocturnal animal, so it will be most easily found at night. And then this map here shows numerous spots where you can pick up jewelry. If you don't have items to sell to a fence, you can go pick them up there. I will be putting this map, along with some of the others, up on Twitter. There's a link down in the description to my Twitter if you'd like to get these maps for yourself. So I hope this helps you out. I'll catch you all next time. Until then, happy hunting and happy trails.